All right, well, we're gonna go ahead and get started, you guys. Um, so how I always like to start my parties is I like to go around, and if you could just introduce me, your, you know, introduce the first name, because I'm terrible with names. Um, so your first name, your least favorite thing to clean, and what you would do with an extra $800. And we're gonna go ahead and start with you, Megan. Thank you so much for having us all out here today. I really appreciate you doing this. No problem. Okay, so your name, well obviously I'm everyone knows you're Megan. Yes, I'm <laughs> Megan, I'm the hostess, and my least favorite thing to clean would be my cooktop. Uh, do you have like a flat stop? I have a of? glass flat stop, and, or flat, it always seems to have like the mark from the pan, um, fingerprints, um, spilled on food. Such a pain to clean mm -hmm. and look nice yes, after I'm great. done. But what would I do with an extra $800? Um, put it towards my kid's college fund. Oh, yeah, that's um, a big one. That's a big yeah, one. So. Okay, awesome. And then Jen, um, right? You're Jen, right? Okay. Yes. So um, what would you, or what is your least favorite thing to clean? Um, I would have to say. So my least favorite thing to clean is um, shower doors. Absolutely hate cleaning the shower doors with all that soap scum. Um, you know, in the past I've had to spray those toxic chemicals all over it and then, you know, run out of the room because it smells so bad and I don't want to gag. Other thing, dusting. I absolutely hated dusting, always have, just because mostly, like, when I would clean all the, you know, it's a tedious job, picking up all the knickknacks, and then it seems like an hour later, all that dust is returned. So I hate that job. Um, so what I'm going to be showing you guys today um, is a really great package um, to start with. And... Um, so first of all, though, who's never even heard of Norwex before? Okay, yeah, great. Um, I love introducing this to new people because you have no idea what's in store for you. This is going to change like everything. So Norwex's mission is to improve quality of life by radically reducing the chemicals in your home. And how they do that is mostly with microfiber, and we do have a few other cleaners as well for different problem areas. But um, they're they're most well known for their microfiber. And I'm gonna tell you why, because you're gonna look at a lot of this stuff and think I have the same thing at home. Um, what's the big deal about her microfiber? And so I'm just gonna to explain to you a couple of things that make our microfiber stand out. Okay, make it better than the stuff that you could get at like the dollar store or you know any value store. Um, so a few things. Our microfiber has, um, well, all, any microfiber to, to qualify as microfiber, the fibers themselves have to be at least one sixth the thickness of a human hair. So that's like taking a hair and splitting it six times. Our microfiber is one two hundredth the thickness of a human hair. So um, it, the fibers are actually microscopic. And what that means for us when we're cleaning is it's actually going to pick up anything larger than that from the surface. So that means it's going to pick up 99% of bacteria from the surface with just water and a cloth. Okay, because the smaller the fibers, the more it can pick up. So the other thing about our microfiber that others don't have is a star-shaped weave. It's a special weave. So once it's picking up all of those fibers, it traps it up inside the cloth and doesn't let it back out to spread on all of the other surfaces. Okay, and then the third thing about our cloth is something that's called back lock technology. What that does is um, that's going to purify the cloth. Um, that goes to work, it, it's a micro silver. I don't know if you guys know anything about silver. And what silver um, does, they've been using it for thousands of years and it won't let bacteria reproduce. So normally that bacteria is reproducing at such a rapid you know, speed inside your cloth that they start to stink over like really quickly by like the next day. Our is not gonna let that um, reproduce inside and it's not gonna get as stinky. Um, so, so yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a quick little demo with these cloths um, to show you, okay? This one, they all say what they are on the tag, by the way, and these two are both in the starter pack that I'm showing you. This one's called the Enviro Cloth. If you can remember E for Enviro, E for everything. This can clean like everything in your bathroom, your appliances. I mean, I've gotten stains on the carpet with this stuff. That's great for spills, everything. So you would just wet it with water, Fold it in half, fold it in half again so that you can pick up all of those fibers. Then this one is called your window cloth. Again, says it on the tag. You're gonna use it not just for windows, anything like a window that you want to be streak free and not, um, you know, and shiny. So windows, of course, mirrors, yes, 
um, and, and you know, and glass, but also chrome fixtures, stainless steel, um, any appliance like stovetops, like you were saying, Megan, like you want to go over it with those because you don't want it streaky. Um, so you're going to go over that with, with this. Um, so I'm going to do a quick little demo with my cloths that I already have here. So I have this one already wet with water. Um, and again, fold it in half, fold it in half again. So those fibers can clean up everything they're going to touch. I take my window cloth and I just keep it over my shoulder as I'm going around cleaning. And um, I'm going to clean the window. I'm going to put some butter on the window. And I'm just going to watch, you can watch as I clean that off real quick. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just put some butter on here. And you know how greasy and messy that is. And I just take my little cloth right here, wet with water. I'm just going to wipe it right off. And I don't know if any of you saw the um, article that was just put out actually last month that um, they did a 20-year study on women who are using spray cleaners and the equivalent of using spray cleaners over a 20 year period of time is the equivalent of smoking 20 cigarettes a day, a pack a day. I, I read that. I was like, are you kidding me? That's awful. So anyway, you just wipe this off, get all the butter off. Then you take your window cloth and you just go over it. No streaks. You're never going to look at windows the same, like in a storefront or anywhere. You'll never look at them the same again because you're going to have no streaks. We're not putting a product on here, and those products leave residue behind. And this, there's only water, so there's no residue. All the butter has been removed. No streaks when the sun shines through later. It's just completely, completely clean. So, there's a glare in my hair. But you can see, no streaks. So now I'm going to do another demo real quick with some chicken. So, hold on. Okay, I'm going to get out. This is our Norwex cutting board, too, by the way. And this is... Um, actually made out of um, rice husks, which is more durable than plastic, so you're not going to get all of those deep grooves in it that can just harbor all that bacteria. It's also biodegradable. It has this little silicone thing underneath it so it doesn't slide around. So what I am going to do is I am going to put some raw chicken right here. And... And then I'm going to take this little protein tester. It is not made by Norwex, but by a company called Hygiena. And these are medical grade protein testers. They test for protein, which is smaller than bacteria. So if it can pick up the protein, it can also pick up the bacteria. So I'm just going to rub it in here and you're going to see pretty quickly that this is going to turn purple because there is lots of protein. Let me get some white to put it up against here. So you guys can see that, yeah, so if you look at the bottom, you can see that that's purple. Yeah, because there's less protein. So now I'm going to take my cloth here, and I'm just going to wipe it down, but I'm going to wipe the whole thing. So if you were wiping down your kitchen counter, you know, you'd be spreading chicken juice all over. But this, because of those fibers, they're so fine there, it's able to pick it all up. And because of the weave, it traps it in the cloth and doesn't spread it back out on all of your surfaces. So I'm going to take another little protein tester here. And I'm going to rub where my chicken was, plus just the whole thing. So that you can see it didn't, you know, spread that all over the place. Okay. This one, you're going to see, is green. I know Valerie's like, oh my gosh, that's crazy. But, um, you know, it just picked it all up. So this is a different way of cleaning than what we're used to. We're used to um, taking chemicals like wipes and things like that and just killing all of that bacteria and everything. Um, this is a mechanical clean. So we are removing the bacteria that's there and trapping it up into the cloth and, you know, until we rinse out the cloth or wash it out. So oh, what was that, Susan? How do you clean your cloths? How do you launder them? Do they go in the dryer? Okay, great, great question. So um, because of that silver, you'll kind of remember that um, that's going to work purifying your cloth, but you do need to wash them, um, just not nearly as often as you would be washing most of your cloths and things. So um, I'm gonna show you 
um, these, these are our, our dryer balls because one thing you want to remember when you do wash them is you can't use fabric softener or dryer sheets because they do what they do. They, um, they coat all of your um, cloths, all the fiber, the fibers, and that silver is not going to be able to work. So these are going to replace your dryer sheets and you just throw three of these in your dryer. They're not in, by the way, they're not in this starter pack. They're a great addition to it. They're also, I just want to point out too, when you host your own party, you get so much free stuff. You get a bunch of free money that you can spend on whatever you want. And that's one of the things that hostesses will do first. They're like, oh my gosh, I have to get those dryer balls. So they put that on their list. But, um, but anyway, what you do is you put these in the dryer. You're going to reduce your drying time by about 30%. And um, you just put all three in and they just get, you know, all that hot air circulating through your clothes and will dry your um, clothes faster, which will save you on um, energy. And if you are getting static, you need to reduce the drying time even further because static is caused by over drying things. So you'll definitely want to reduce your drying time even more. You're not going to need as much drying time, again, because these cut back on that. Um, so also dryer sheets are your third most toxic chemical in your home. A lot of people didn't know that. Um, I didn't know that when I started doing this. Um, first is like your drain cleaner and your oven cleaners, and then your fabric softener and dryer sheets. And we're putting that on our skin, which is our largest organ. So that is, you know, being soaked right into your skin. So that's, that's really unhealthy too. Um, but anyway, you can use these instead of those dryer sheets. The other thing you do want to remember about laundering your products um, is they recommend, Norwex recommends a biodegradable laundry detergent that is filler free and additive free. We have one right here. This is, um, comes in this starter pack. So this is great. This is great to use with all of your cloths. And when I first saw this little bag, I was like, that's not going to last me a week in my house with my three kids. But um, you use the tiniest little bit of this. And, and it even says here, so it's 100% it's biodegradable. Um, there are no phosphates or sulfates, no chlorine bleach, no fillers, no optical brighteners, no animal testing, no dyes or fragrances. So, um, so you're going to just use, you're not even going to believe this, you guys. So between a half a teaspoon and a teaspoon, if you have an energy efficient machine, like the HE machine, very, very little bit. If you don't have that kind of machine, you're just going to use a half a teaspoon, which isn't much more. So you're going to be saving so much money using this stuff. Um, and this is great. Now, if you do have stains and things on your clothes, and I'm talking for a whole load of laundry, not just your cloths here. But if you have stains and things like that on your clothes, you do want to pre-treat as you always would for anything. Um, I pre-treat by, I take a little pinch of this, put it in the, in the sink with my, whatever it is that's stained, and just kind of soak it in there overnight. Um, and it works amazing. Um, I have gotten all sorts of things out. Blueberries, um, red wine, uh, blood, tons of mud, rust, I mean, you name it. So um, I absolutely love this stuff. And they, they recommend using something like this for all of the cloths. And it does come in the starter pack, so that's great. Um, okay, so another thing that's in this package that I absolutely love and couldn't live without is the cleaning paste and the two Spiri sponges. So these um, are great because they're just a little bit scrubbier, but they won't scratch surfaces. The cleaning paste, the three active ingredients in this are marble flour, natural soap, and coconut oil. And you would just get this wet, put it in here, and then just clean things that are really hard to clean, like the soap scum, like that we were talking about before. And I know, Jen, um, you were talking about, you and Megan both were saying those stovetops. This stuff is amazing on the stovetop. And um, Jen, you were saying like your, that ring that you could never get off. You can get that off. I mean, this is a, this stuff is crazy good. I've gotten Sharpie off of hardwood floors. Um, I, so tile, we're out. Now, if you are using tile, I might not recommend this particular sponge because you might end up wearing a hole in it. But um, toothbrushes with this, great on grout. Um, so this stuff is just, you know, they refer to this as gold in a jar, miracle in a jar. I mean, I've heard it all. It's elbow grease in a jar. Because this, and this one little thing, you use such a tiny bit, this is going to last you about a year if not more. My dad always says this is going to last until he dies because, I mean, he, it is a lot. So, I mean, it, it goes very far. A tiny bit goes far. So, two of these are in there. So, what I do is I keep one. I keep this in my shower a lot of times. I keep my shower, one sponge in my shower, and one in the kitchen to wash pots and pans and stuff because it won't even scratch like your Teflon. So, it's great. Um, another product you can live without is the dust mitt. Now, I do want to say 
only one of the dust mitts comes in the starter pack. But again, when you host your own party, you get so much free stuff and you can use that money. And once you have one, you're going to want the other one. And I will kind of show you why. Okay. When you are dusting with this stuff, Hey, I, dusting was my least favorite thing. Let me take them off for a second. But um, dusting was my least favorite thing to clean because it like pulled it, you know, after the dust, um, after you sprayed your cleaner down, um, like, you know, like we always do, that spray is a dust like magnet. Okay. It tracks all that dust on the surface. When you're done dusting, it's continuing to do its job and track more dust. So you're cleaning, you're stirring up dust all in the house. It's going right to those surfaces that you sprayed. So you get that buildup like an hour after you've dusted. Certainly the next day, everything is like covered in dust again. So this, these things are going to save you so much time. It's unbelievable. You're not going to have to dust nearly as often. And if you hate dusting as much as I do, then um, you're going to love And like you too, Valerie, I know you were saying you hate dusting. Um, this is going to, if you don't have to do it as often, then that's amazing. I mean, I still don't like it. I don't have to do it as often though. And it's so much faster when you have these two. I'm just going to show you really quickly. Um, like you just you wipe the surface when you pick up like your knickknacks. It's like, okay, picked it up. That's dusted. Um, put it back down. And when they're both covered in dust on both sides, you then, if you have two, you just switch hands. And now you have a clean side on both sides and you continue to dust. When they're both dusty on all sides, you go outside, clap it off and, um, and then, then keep going again. To wash these, the same rules as the rest of it. No, um, no dryer sheets. Oh, and I didn't mention before, no bleach. You cannot use bleach on any of these things. Bleach will weaken the fibers and you'll get holes in your cloth. So um, we also, we have a two-year warranty on all our microfiber too. If you're using bleach, you're not, it's, it's not going to last you two years. So keep that in mind. Um, another thing uh, that's in this package. These, these, oh, love these things. This is your kitchen towel and your kitchen cloth. Okay. These are, I, I use these multiple times a day. The, the big towel is to dry your dishes, we dry hands, and it has that back cloth in it so it doesn't get stinky. I know that for me, I used to have to put my dish towel on top of the washing machine like every night because it would just start to stink, and I didn't want to dry my hands with a stinky towel or dry our dishes we're going to eat off of. So um, I got this. I was shocked at just how long I could leave this up in the kitchen. Um, it was, yeah, I know. Megan's like shaking her head, yeah, over here. Because, I mean, because you can leave it in there for so long, and... Um, and it just doesn't smell. And I know you were probably like me, like, you know, like I'm always like smelling it. Like, why doesn't it smell? Like it's, it's just kind of crazy. So it goes a lot longer than your other things that, you know, to smell. This is a smaller version. This is great to just wipe your kitchen counters down after a quick meal. So, or any meal. Um, so it has these little grooves and the crevices that picks up all of those crumbs and stuff. So it's just a quick wiping down your counters. These are great. They dry really fast. They're so absorbent. So you dry like a whole bunch of dishes with this one and it's just like they keep drying and drying and drying. It's just amazing. And then when you, you know, put them out too dry, you're like, okay, I've used this already. Plus some cells dry really fast. So these, I just couldn't live without them. They come in lots of different cute colors and stuff too to match your kitchen. Um, these are the ones that are in the starter pack. You'll want, you'll want more than one of these, I can tell you. Last thing in this um, package, this is, these are the body cloths. So these are the things I feel like most people are most skeptical about at first until you actually use them. They are kind of like an Enviro cloth, but for your body. You can use just water and these cloths to wash your face and take off all of your makeup, believe it or not. And um, until you do it, you won't believe that. Your mascara, everything, foundation, completely wiped off with water and a cloth better than any makeup remover you're ever going to use. So you can, and you don't have to, yes, you can use them with soap, but you can wash your entire body without soap. And I'll just tell you from me, my experience, when I tried that the first time, I really just wanted to see if it was going to work. Um, and, you know, since I was going out and telling people about this stuff, the reason I did not go back to soap after that, I have been like soap free for almost four years now, um, is because just using no soap, my skin felt so much better. It was so much less dry and flaky and just itchy. I never even knew my skin was like, you know, dry, flaky, and itchy until I stopped using soap. And then I was like, wow, my skin just feels so much better. So I've never gone back. Uh, my husband was a little later. You know, he was like, mm, I'm going to use soap. So he used soap for a little while. But honestly, after a couple of months, he just stopped. And 
um, has never gone back. We take these everywhere. We take them on every trip with us. The kids use them. I mean, this cut back on the kids' soap I was using, my face soap, my body soap. They gently exfoliate. So the um, exfoliating, any kind of exfoliating thing, um, and makeup remover or makeup remover claws. I mean, this thing, these will save you a fortune. These are the best. So these are the last things in this um, starter pack. Um, so it's, I mean, this is, this package, it's just like, it's gonna, it's a little bit for every room in your home and it's gonna, you're gonna see the biggest, like, oh my gosh, this stuff is saving me some serious money once you start using all of these things and you're gonna just be so amazed when you, when you start here, okay? Um, so also just to let you know, when you host your own party, you get to go home with these two little samples of these um, today because I do want you using them right away. And honestly, so they're samples, okay? So they're little cuts from those cloths, but let me tell you, you're gonna be shocked at how much you can clean with just these little samples. And you will want you will want the big ones. You'll be like waiting for this package to come in. But um, these samples, I, and I want you to go home so you can talk about your friends, clean everything with them. Clean your greasy bacon out of the microwave um, with these cloths. But they are gonna be, you're gonna be super, super excited. Honestly, I took these home for my first party and I was like, oh yeah, I'm in. I'm gonna sign up to sell this stuff because I'm gonna tell everyone about it. So, um, you know, they are amazing. Um, so you're gonna get that as one of the things um, when you host your party that you can go home with tonight. Now, I'm gonna tell you, last product I'm really gonna talk about today is um, our mop system, okay? This is the main reason um, that you want to host your own party. So, because our mop is, <clears throat> it is our most expensive item. It is worth every penny. However, it's better to get it for free. And when you host your own party, you can get it for either a discount or completely free. And just so you know, another way to completely get it for free is signing on as a consultant. This is in the package that consultants get when they start. So, um, so I'm gonna tell you a little bit about it. Okay. When you have your mop, this pad I have on it right now, this is like a dust mitt. This is a dry mop, um, and it, or the dry pad. And it's like just like the dust mitt, but for your floor. And when you step on the base of this, okay, you would just step on it, and then you can adjust this to nose level, and then so that if you're tall, you're short, whatever, you can go ahead and just and mop with this. When you're all done mopping the floor with a dry pad, you would take this rubber brush and just take all this, all that dirt and grime, and, or you know, dog hair and um, whatever, dust and stuff, and go right into the trash can and get this, all that into the trash can. This rubber brush is really great if you do have pets too. Gets all that hair off of like their favorite chair or the back of the car and everything. So you would use this to get all that off, then just rip this off and hang it back up in your closet. Done with the dry pack. Then you're going to use this. This is the wet pad, and this one you just get wet with water, and um, you just roll it up, squeeze out the extra water, and then you would just go around and clean all your floor. You're gonna have a streak-free shine because you're not gonna have all that residue that is leaving, you know, all of those streaks behind. It's just plain clean, and it dries so fast. Like under a minute, your floor is like dry because you're just putting a little bit, just dampening the floor. The microfiber is what's cleaning it. And um, so you're going to just clean everything off, no harsh chemicals, not having to go out and replenish all of that stuff. You have pets, you have kids crawling around on the floor. They're not getting into all those toxic chemicals. Um, so, and it's also so nice and big, it's going to cover so much surface area. So this thing, people just absolutely love this thing. It is, we're quite well known for our mop system. Um, and again, I'm going to go into what you get when you host a party. And I'm going to kind of explain how you can get this for free at your party. So, okay. All right, you guys, I've been seeing over here, I have been, had this out, this little display of products. Okay, I just want you to see this. This is, guys, this is what you get in an average size party. So I'm just going to go through what's in it and, um, and know that you can get all of this stuff for, um, and I'll put this down so you guys can see a little better, um, completely for free. So we have an amazing little hostess program right here that you can take a look at. And But like I said, I'm showing you the average size party. Average sales of a party is 620 in sales, okay? So 
four. And so to get this package of stuff, I'm going to take a couple of these things out for a minute. All of this stuff you see right in here, you're going to get for having at least 620 in sales at your party and at least one booking. So, you know, one person saying, hey, I'm going to do a party and get all that stuff myself. And it's also going to be helping Megan out, too. So um, all of that stuff you'd be getting for average size sales and at least one book. Okay? Then, but that's not it. They keep throwing more stuff at you. Um, so you get for the number of fine guests you have. Let's say you have five guests, and that includes people who aren't at your party, um, who couldn't come. I know that Megan had two orders as soon as I walked in the door that she gave me, and she was already talking about Judy who's going to um, order. And just think of other people who couldn't you know, come to your party. So if you have five fine guests, you get an Enviro cloth. Just add it to this. Eight fine guests, kitchen cloth, ten fine guests, body pack. And it keeps going up from there, but I'm only showing you average size. Then you get free money. So before, when I was saying, you know, oh, you can get those dryer balls for free or that extra dustman, anything you want. You can just pick out whatever you want. Um, I just happened to show a little chenille hand towel and our drying mat. Um, and quite frankly, that is, you'd even be getting more than that at an average size party. But that's all I have in mind. So let's say, throw in another dustman because you're going to get more. Um, <clears throat> so... If you are interested in hosting your own party, getting all that stuff free, um, I mean, by all means, you're going to you know, want to do that. So you're going to have to let me know, okay? And we're checking out later. Um, last thing we're going to do is we're going to play a quick little game. Uh, I hate games, but I do like to get free prizes. So if you guys want some free prizes, <laughs> that's what we're going to do. Um, so, Megan, if you could help me with this. Do you have a phone with a timer on it? Yes, I do. Okay, awesome. What I want you to do is just put two minutes on there. And this game, this game is called Ask Me About My Job. And so you're simply going to, guys, be asking me questions about my job. So you can ask me things like, you know, how much do you make at a party? Or are there extra perks that you can get besides making money? Or, um, you know, how many parties do you have to do? How much does it cost to sign up? Anything... Anything you can think of that is job related. Because again, it's called asking about my job. So you can't ask me about the laundry detergent or the cleaning phase or anything right now. Um, you can ask me those questions later, but this is strictly just questions about my job. Ooh, there's a flicker in here. <laughs> and, um, oh, okay, good. <laughs> okay, so when you ask me a question about my job, you get a ticket. Um, and you only have two minutes, so if you don't mind, those like kind of raising your hand, and we're going to move really quickly through them so that more tickets can be handed out and you'll be able to win, um, win a prize. So, Megan, you have two minutes on there. Okay, perfect. Great. Okay. Uh, Go. I have a question. Okay. Um, Susan, yes. How, how much will it cost me to sign up to be a consultant? Is there a fee that I have to incur? Great question. That is my, like, one of my favorite. Um, here you go. Um, it is actually free to sign up. Um, well, you do pay $10 and change um, for um, shipping of a great starter pack. That includes uh, the mop and a whole bunch of other items. You have a sale requirement that's extremely easy to hit. You have three months, 90 days, okay, to reach that sale requirement. If you don't, then they would charge you $200 for all of the stuff that they give you, which they actually give you closer to $300 worth of stuff. But... Um, but you know, if you did absolutely nothing, then you'd have to pay that. But 90% of consultants actually hit that and, and don't have to pay that. Okay. Yes. Uh, so my question for you is, do you have to keep any inventory or buy any special inventory to keep at your house? Oh, good question. Okay. So she was asking me about inventory. Yeah. You do not have to have any inventory at your house. Okay. Which is great because you don't have the storage for that. You don't have to buy this stuff. Okay, this is like your online store, so you place their orders, and it is shipped out from their warehouse. Just so you know, all of this stuff that I have here, I have earned this for free. They give you so much stuff for free, so I didn't have to buy all of this inventory if you're thinking that. So this isn't really inventory. This is my stuff to, to show. Oh, already. Time is up. Quick. Okay. All right. Um, so that's the um, end of the tickets, but Valerie, I know um, you were asking me about um, how much do you, you were, your hand was up and you were saying something about how much do I make or something. So um, so on average, if you guys remember in the beginning of the party, I asked you all, 
what would you do with an extra eight hundred dollars? That, if you could just fit in one party a week, that would be an extra eight hundred dollars because on average you make about two hundred dollars at a party. So, um, do you have to do that many? No, but if you are like, you know, you can figure out based on what you need to make. If you need to make an extra four hundred, then two parties a month, okay? So you can kind of adjust it based on what you want to make. Um, it's your schedule, I love that flexibility. So it's, you know, however many you wanna do when you wanna do it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pull these tickets and someone is going to get a prize. You are gonna get today, ooh, our fruit and veggie scrub cloth. I love this thing, this is great. You can clean your carrots and your all your fruits and vegetables, get that waxy film off of there, um, your potatoes, um, this just is great. I couldn't live without this thing. And, okay, five, seven, five. Who's that? Ooh. Ooh, okay, here you go. Yay. Here you go, Jen. Congratulations. All right, don't, if you didn't win anything, that's okay. You're going to have one more opportunity. So, what I want you to do, um, I am going to give out these index cards to all of you. Okay, so. Yeah, just to pass those around if you don't mind. Okay, on your index card, what I want you to write is your name at the top and your birthday because I do birthday discounts. So um, just go ahead and put that down. Number one, you're gonna write your cell number because I, um, I text you your birthday discount. So go ahead and write your cell. Number two, it's gonna be yes, no, or maybe to if you are interested in hosting your own party, getting like all that free stuff, helping Megan out, and introducing all of your friends to all of this amazing stuff. Okay, that's yes, no, or maybe to your own party. Number three, um, if you are interested in the business opportunity, okay, and you wanna see how we can fit this into your life, then you are gonna write yes, no, or maybe. I will give you a little brochure um, at checkout, and we'll set up a time to chat. Number four, okay, um, this is, about, oh no, just to write your email address there. And number five, I have a little fa a Facebook VIP group where I do lots of giveaways and I always announce my specials there first. If you write your name that's on Facebook, I can, um, if you want to be added to that group, go ahead and do that and um, I'll edge that group. I'm gonna collect these. As soon as you're done, just hold them up. Great, thank you, thank you. Awesome, okay. Okay, so I'm going to pull a name for a, another prize, and this is for, ooh, our optic scarf. I love this thing. This is the best for cleaning your glasses, your little iPhone screens, and, and you know, iPads and all that other good stuff. This one happens to be the camouflage one, which is great. My little, my son uses this for his glasses. He keeps it on his book bag. Is and there antibacterial stuff in there? This, or? this one um, doesn't. Let's see, does it have the back lock in it? I don't believe it has the back lock in this. Um, so what you're gonna do though, but this is gonna be great for if you have like anti-glare on your phones, you're gonna be able, I mean not on your phones, on your um, eyeglasses, you're gonna be able to get, you know, not wreck that and take that off or anything like that. And I just simply, I do wash it the same way I wash everything else. I don't wash it nearly as often, honestly. I can't even tell you last time I washed it, but um, this is great. And this is going to be, <laughs> <laughs> Be careful there. Okay, Susan! Woo! Yay! Here you go, girl. All right. Thank you. Great. Okay, so I'm going to hand out the folders in just a minute. I'm going to quick go through what's in them, though. So I will be giving each of you a folder, okay? Right here is the order form. And if you can just put all your contact information up at the top, you don't have to worry about the order numbers and stuff like that. I can help you with that. Um, if, you have, if you're going to buy something and you wanted to use a Visa or MasterCard, if you could put that information at the bottom before you even come up, it just speeds things along. Um, then over here, this is the picture of the starter pack that I've been showing you. This is called the Safe Haven Package. And I do have a catalog in here. It's a little overwhelming for those of you who are completely new. So um, this just kind of makes it easier and faster. And you can just write on here, starter pack, and I can help you with that. There's the liquid um, detergent in here and the price for that or the powder price, which is the one that I was talking about. I didn't get into the liquid much, but I can tell you a little more about that too. Um, then you're going to see these are the hostess specials for um, for next month. And since we're already done, um, we're in the last week of, of February here. So this um, 
these are going to be for March, and they're amazing um, products that I just showed you in the basket a little while ago. So if you're interested in that, let me know. And and then, so I'm going to give these all out to you, and I'm going to be over in the dining room, which is like my little office for um, tonight. And if you don't mind just coming up one at a time so I can just spend time with each of you. And when I'm done, they will just call for the next person to come over. Okay? Sound good? Okay, let me get these. Give them out. 